buy, consume, marry, reproduce. Yo everybody, this is Rob with Great aka The Toy Bookie coming to you with another toy review and another 8 inch retro line cloth NECA Toys toy review. <laughs> These things, I've been hooked on them as you can tell on the channel, I've been doing a lot of reviews of them. And this was a set that I've been seeing for only like $80, $90, like above retail. And now that they're making the Nada figure and the Frank figure that I bought, I actually pre-ordered the, the Nada Roddy Piper figure, and I actually just, I so, I'm so dumb. I had the Frank in my cart from uh, Scream or Shout Factory, I always get them mixed up. Whatever, the, uh, I think it's Scream Factory. Frank figure that we're getting uh, from NECA Toys that's only to that thing, and they were selling the figure alone for 40 bucks. And I'm such a dope, I had two of them in my cart, for like days and didn't buy them and they sold out and then uh, once I bought this figure I went back and I, I bought the like the whole deluxe set for like $80, $90 but I'll, I'm gonna get a DVD and a poster and stuff so I'm not really mad about that uh, but I could have had the figure just for you know 40 bucks but this figure I actually found on a website that was a random I just tried this random website they sold like kids stuff and uh, I found this set for $50 ship. Impressive. Now, I think that was the original retail, but I've only ever seen it at like GameStop. It was like $80 online on eBay and stuff. It's like 80 bucks. You are getting two cloth retro figures. Now, this set is really cool um, and it's really nice. Like I like the set alone. Like I, I almost didn't want to open it. But I thought, you know what, when I get all the figures, I'm going to open all the They Live figures and put them on a shelf. So I thought, you know what, I might, I might as well just open this. I don't plan on reselling it. So, you know, I'm always an open box guy. Like, I wouldn't even, if I kept this, even though I do like it in the box, like, what would, what, it would just be in storage anyway. So in today's video, we are going to be opening this thing up and we're going to take a look. And uh, hopefully th those other figures get released soon so we can complete or, you know, fill out our They Live figure shelf. Perfect. A 2020 uh, version of this movie would say, Wear your mask. Wear your mask. Don't you, don't you dare. But, um, yeah, man, I, I love the messaging of this movie. Um, and I think more people in 2020 could give that movie a watch. Okay. Here we go. We got the figures right here. Wow. I always loved the alien look of these They Live figures, man. Very cool. Here's the back. Stay asleep. No ideas. Yup. Sounds like 2020. Um, I really, ooh. Yeah, this set is so cool. Like, I, I it, you almost don't want to open it. But you know what? What we do on this channel is we open things. So, very cool. And you get two figures out of this. Boom. Pop that open. I don't want to cut anything. So, we're going to do this nicely. Alright, so here we are, everything out of the pack, and if, if you weren't paying attention, you would actually think these are accessories, because they look just like, do not eat, buy, no ideas. Like, that's pretty funny, I just, I just thought I would include that, so stupid. But, um, you get Obey, you get the magazine on the, the imagination, no imagination, watch TV, subscribe to my YouTube channel, send me super chats in my live, stay asleep, we got buy. Send me super chats. Submit. Marry and re now this is the only one I, I agree with. I think getting married and reproducing is a fine thing. Not when I was younger. The older you get, I think you you know you you uh, warm up to a lot of these things. No ideas. Buy. Same stuff. Very cool. I, I <laughs> the the messaging of this movie is very fun and um I definitely think a lot of uh. Kids today could watch it and, and, and gain some stuff from it. Now, Obey, we got Obey on the... Now, it, the one thing that annoys me is, um, you know, Shepard Ferry took that Obey and he kind of like corned it up. Like Zoomies, everyone's wa reads, like has those Obey out, like outfits and and uh, Zoomies and, and uh, you know what I mean? Like they kind of like ruined the coolness of uh, the movie. In my opinion, but uh, I think this is actually the same TV from the um, the season of the witch three pack that we got from NECA Toys, which is funny because um, they're both John Carpenter movies, which is really cool. Obey. Well, okay, so we looked at everything. Now let's take a look at the figures. 
Sorry guys, I think I fell asleep mid-review. I'm getting very tired. This is like my fourth review shot in a day right now. So, so here we are. Let's see, do these guys stand? Ooh, he's got a weird ankle. Right out of the box, he's got a weird ankle. But he does have this cool head. Now I would like to cast up these heads um, with that alien look and so I could make like a horde. You know, you throw them on some, you find a cheap cloth body from NECA and you could throw those heads on more figures Perfect. to get like uh, a bunch of people for Nada to, you know, to bop. Now here we go, we got the woman. Now the woman has a lot of accessories which is cool. Again, these sculpts are just really beautiful. Their hands are, are beautifully sculpted too. Look at their hands. They got like, that's a special sculpt right there. She's got a wristwatch on. They got clothing. Uh, now, I don't think we've seen a woman body besides Pamela Voorhees and the Golden Girls, but I think they had male bodies. Now, this is might be a new mold. He has the old style body. We just did a review of the Halloween 2 Michael Myers figure, and that figure is like a new mold. It's got ab crunch. It's got double jointed arms. It's got ankle pivot. Uh, this figure does not. This has the traditional 8 inch retro line. Very stiff, but it works. It works, but very, um, you know, like just there. It's like very static articulation. Single jointed or double jointed arms? Single jointed arms, single jointed knees, single jointed uh, ankles, nothing. Oh, bop, she's done. And oh, even the neck. They even painted the neck on these figures. Very cool, man. I, oh, he has a watch also. The, just the attention to details, really cool. I gotta put, I gotta resituate the suit, these cloth figures. The, a lot of people were like, these cloth figures are basically, we're getting into doll territory, and we are, but you know what? Who cares? It's, you know, it's fun. Not a lot. They definitely grew on me, these, these uh, figures. Now for 50 bucks, the set is worth it, I think, but if you're not gonna probably pay 50 bucks, you're gonna be, not probably find it for that. Um, let me see. And without, without the John and Frank figures, there's really not much you could do with these except just put them on the shelf, which, you know, they'll look great on any, any uh, movie shelf. So I guess that's it. There's not much more I could stretch out and talk about these figures. They are great. If you like the movie, you're going to pick them up, right? And you're going to get the Frank and the Nada. And, and um, maybe we'll even get that girl. I forgot what her name is. But um, that's it, guys. I'm out of here. This is Rock of the Great, a.k.a. The Toy Bookie, coming to you with another chill, laid-back toy review. And uh, stay tuned for my other videos, stay tuned for my lives, we have a lot of fun on my lives, and remember, hit that like button, comment below, hit the notification bell, buy, consume, marry, reproduce, and we're out of here, peace, stay great. Okay.